doing today? I don't know what's going on. Howdy, happy uh, Sunday to my Facebook family. Oh, this is concert 353. Yes, yes, thank you, Timmy. Uh, Timmy took on the, the daunting task of counting them all for me. Uh, which means that I, I guess in two years, I've been on every other day for a concert somewhere, if you count all of it. It's a lot of concerts. And some of you have been to every single one of them. I know it's Super Bowl, so stick around as long as you can. I'm going to end well before it, a whole hour before it. And at the end, I'm going to give away a CD and uh, one of my brother's calendars. With paintings on them. You should definitely check out his website. It's really, he's really, it's got a really good one. One glad morning when this life is over, I'll, I'll fly away. When I die, hallelujah, by and by, I'll fly away. song a lot faster but sometimes you know this just happens uh stars are going to compassion international which is a really great charity that helps uh find home uh help support children all over the world i found it through michael w smith's concert 25 years ago i remember at the back of his concert there's a you could fought you could adopt a child and i and i and and they give 97% to the kids. It's a really, really generous in terms of what ends up getting actually to the to the to the kid to the children. Mm -hmm. 
I love it. I love it. Anyway, that's where stars are going. Stars that are a penny. If you, uh, woo, somebody just gave a shooting star. And it, it, looked, it just looked like a really fun jazz machine, jazzercise on my thing. I don't know. Some, someone just gave something and danced all over my screen. I can't really see your comments today. Oh, there we go. Sandra, I see you now. Okay. I lift my eyes up Where does my help come from? I lift my head up Where does my hope come from? Where does my In the middle of my soul, there lied a hope only you could satisfy. Hear the longing of my cry. I lift my head up. Where does my hope? I look for shelter in the shadow of your wings. I need forgiveness and the, and the comfort that it brings. Where does my Oh, I walk through 
the valley of oh, oh, death, I will fear no evil. For your rod and your staff will they come for me. I am not alone. I am not alone. you guys down <laughs> I uh, without this thing falling because it's gonna fall oh, oh that's tricky how am I gonna do this how am I gonna do it if I put my back into it okay maybe that's a little better maybe that's a little better I just want you to be a little more my eye line um, I got uh, friends here in my room on zoom a zoom room Kay wants old rugged cross. You got it. Please remind me because I want to do that. I'm going to do Grace with Jeanette. And then we got As the Deer. Bonita wants What a Friend. Uh, Bettina wants Be a Light for Tammy. For sure. Tammy's sending her messages on Facebook. Or faxing her or something.
coming to this place Fill us with your mercy Flood us with your grace No more fear No more blame No more guilt And no more shame Hallelujah, to this place fill us with your mercy and flood us with your grace no more fear no more blame no
come into this place Fill us with your mercy and flood us with your grace No, no more fear No pain Well, that's on my new record. Thanks for that request. Uh, that's called that's called Grace, uh, and it's from my latest album, Long Way Home. Now we have a featured member uh, of our between our Facebook group and our our YouTube group, our VIP, and she gets acknowledged. She gets to pick a song, and she gets sent a a signed headshot. And her name, drum roll, is. Sounds like a big cat. Sounds like a big cat. Here we go. Sounds like a big cat. Here we go. Sounds like a big cat. Ladies and gentlemen, Lynn Holmes is our featured member, and she requested uh, some originals, Let It Go, The Stone, and Long Way Home. So I haven't done The Stone in a minute, so I think The Stone wins. Loop this a little differently with the uh, the stone. No.
song I wrote when I was a, a, a wee grasshopper. Uh, it's, it's, it, had, no, no, it hasn't really changed. I mean, the feel has changed a bit. It's a little bit more like that. Okay, let me get, okay, so there you go to our featured member, Lynn Holmes. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you all for the stars towards the compassion. Well, that sounds cool. It sounds like an 80s thing. I'm gonna use that.
the song you mentioned at? Yes, I came up as Michael W. Smith, not as Keith Green. Uh, I don't know why. Okay, Old Rugged Cross, which has been, uh, do I know the sake of the call? I don't. I've never heard of it. Um, I have never heard of the sake of the call. For the sake of the call. I, I only heard Stephen Chris Chapman a couple times. Surprise, Donna Armstrong. Once I remember. Okay, today is a day to vote for Plea of an Angel, so I think I should plea I should play Plea of an Angel so you'll go vote for it. Sound good? And if you could I think we'll provide you the link and if if I think of everybody. We made a big jump next last time because pretty much everybody on here went uh, over there and voted. So if you could do that again, that would be really cool. But only if you like the song. You do have to vote for six other songs or seven other ones.
So if you could go vote, that would be super swell. Thank you, Paula, for writing that song. That was like a swing rhythm almost, and then it became a swing, a swing, a swing rhythm, a swing, a swing rhythm. Okay, how am I gonna get all these songs done? Oh my goodness. Uh, Lord, you're beautiful from Loy. Let me try that quick. Let me try that. Lo, Lord, you're beautiful, Lord. Yee. Oh, oh, Lord. Oh, boy. That oh always gets me. Oh. Uh, where was I? I was going to do Old Rugged Cross as well. Oh, Lord, you're beautiful. Oh, come on now. Come on now. Uh, Keith Green, 146. Okay, let me do... Uh, yeah, thank you for putting the link there. Please go vote. Let me know when you did. If you direct message me, then I'll know. I appreciate that. Um. Slain. 
Till my trophies At last I lay down Oh, I will claim I'll exchange it someday for a crown. The old rugged cross I will lay. Shame and reproach Gladly bear Oh, you call me someday To my home His glory for heaven I'll share Oh, here is the old rocky cross Till my trophies at last I lay down. I will pray Change it someday for a crown. I love that song for sure. Uh, it is one of my old old time all times uh old time all times all time old times okay this is as the deer for timmy and i know my mom loves this song and then uh i remember i got you on here too okay <laughs> I'd like to open up that one, okay.
hold on our heart's desire and I long to worship you. You alone are my strength, my shield. To you alone may my spirit. alone are my heart's desire, and I long to worship Now I want you more Silver, or you can satisfy. You alone are the real joy giver and the apple of mine. You're my friend, and you are my father, even though. I love you more than any other, so much more than anything. With you, oh Lord, are my strength, my shield. To you alone, may my spirit. And I long to worship you. You alone are my strength, my shield. You alone make my spirit And I long to worship you. You alone are my strength, my shield. You alone in my ceiling. You alone. Oh 
Love you good and hard. All she wants. All she needs is freedom. That song's really evolved for me into like a full-on harmonica song. <laughs> like, I wish I can go back to Nashville and rip my harmonica a bit, but I'd never play... Harmonica's brand new for me, I, I would say, probably. Like, newish in the last... You guys know when I picked it up, right? Like, a year, maybe? 
And so I get in this fancy studio in Nashville about to, uh, um, and, and there's all these world-class musicians around and I'm like, I was a little shy with my harmonica, plus in the mix it's just low, but, but you know, vocals and in certain things you look back and you're like, I wish I could go back and redo them. Like my first album, I wish, because I've done so many concerts since I recorded that, like, you know, three, three and a half, 300, 35, 350, uh, I wish I could go back and recut my vocals. I guess I could, but you know, I hear they're safe and they're, I was trying to get it right in the studio the first time. And the second time I would so much practice, I just played and I just really took risks and didn't care. And, and I prefer my vocals in my second album so much more than my first album. Uh, but that's what happens with growth, right? Uh, Someday I might go back and recut Freedom for Your Soul with just a bit more power, but who knows? Who's got the time? Honestly. I mean, like, actually, what time is it? Okay. Two o'clock. All right. We're doing okay. Are you playing? The drinking game with me, you know, whenever I drink, you guys have to drink. That's a part of the game. That's a part of it. This is the hydration concert. Stick around to the end to win a CD from me and uh, from my brother, a paint uh, calendar. I'm just gonna pick somebody who's shared and say, hey, would you like a calendar? Then you reach out to the Ruth with your address and we send it to you. It sounds easier than it is, but, but, but it'll happen. <laughs> Kimberly's winning the drinking game. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay, I had a plan. I know what it is. I have it. 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 Um, did I start at one? Yeah, I did. Okay, so we're... Feels like I've been playing a little longer than that, which is cool. It's usually the other way around, but I'm fully enjoying myself. <laughs> How's the audio? Is it coming through okay for everybody? George Garcia, thanks for sharing. George, is, are you our only dude here, George? If you're a dude, speak up. Throw up a dude sign, whatever that is. You gotta be careful. Every sign is offensive to somebody. Throw up a dude sign. I don't know. Uh, man, I'm annoyed with how everybody's offended about everything. And this is not a political statement. This is just a like, please get a grip. And like everyone is so easily offended. Like it we're to the Australians, we're the most, we're, we're, it's embarrassing. Like Australians come here and they're like, why does everybody take things so personally and get so offended about everything? Like why can't people just have different ideas and different points of view on things? And if they're not hurting anybody, like, Physically, I mean, people get so emotionally hurt so far. We got to toughen up, man, and, like, stop being such whiners about everything. It makes me crazy. Ask me how I really feel about that. This is a good song for that. having the G there, that's weird. No, there's gotta be another version of a G11. Hold the phone here. Seventh fret, why is it all up there? Fifth fret. It's too complicated, I'm just gonna do it my way. Okay. <laughs>
just for me. There ain't that much difference between you and me at a time full of war will be peace. In a world full of hate be alive. Do somebody wrong, make it right. Go hide in the darkness, know you were born to shine. A world full of hate, be light. La la la. That needs a change to make a difference in a time full of noise. You better listen. Life is but a breeze, better live it. in a place that needs a change. Make a difference. The world full of hate. Be alive. When you do yeah, somebody wrong, make it right. Go hide in the darkness, know you were born to shine.
Thank you very much.
is the way back days when I enjoy playing my own songs way more than covers and today is one of those days. Some days I really love connecting to, you know, other folks' incredible talent and then there's times when I get into my own stuff and I'm like, I really come from the middle of it, you know, rather than try to like find it, it's mine, so but that's kind of obvious I guess, but uh, okay, this is for my mom. Let 
that for my mom once in Vancouver and she's just like instantly became her favorite song okay I think I need to wrap this tuna salad up uh, right away here because uh, I'm hungry and there's a football game on soon and all that stuff okay um let's see let's see let's see Uh, Tracy Spalding, it had to be you. It had to be you. Had to be you. Let me try it. I've, I've never played it before. How does it go? I'm afraid. Uh, uh, I don't know the verses, but, but let's see. It had to be you. Is that the, the song you're talking Frank Sinatra? Why not? Let's try it. Why not? Uh, okay. <laughs> Nobody else. 
else could kiss me through With all your faults, I love you still It had to be you, wonderful you It had to be you Oh my goodness, this is tricky. Let me try one more time. Some, some others I have seen might never be me. And I see the cross and try to be false. They will be new. Cause nobody else gives me a thrill with all your faults. Well, I love you still. It had to be you. Wonderful you, it had to be you. Oh man, that's weird. So, some others, some others, some others I have seen. actually singing in the right key of the chords but you know I think I need to listen to that song again uh, Harry Connick Jr. does it I wonder what chords he used so sometimes it's rolling the dice guys oh this looks better why didn't I find Harry Connick Jr.'s version uh, I wandered around It's, it's a weird, it's a weird, uh, uh, thank you for your patience. Uh, I thought it was going to be like so easy, but uh, they're not always, they're not always. Oh, there's... Always 
Just tell me the things I need to hear. You remind me I got no end to fear through my best friend. Yeah, you're my best friend. Sing with me now. When I'm fat, when I'm thin, when I'm cold, but in sin with my cords and the gaps. When I'm low on cash, with my fate is dry. And I'm wondering why you're my best friend. You're my best friend. We got, uh, we got, uh, Marianne doesn't, or, uh, Veronica doesn't want to wake up your sleeping family. Is it in the middle of the night, Veronica? Marianne Schumer's here. Thanks for being here. Uh, so, and Chivola is here. She likes that version. Joy Holgerman, Minnie, Hurl Holgerman. Giveaway time. Now, if I pick you and you've won recently, like in the last, I don't know, 60 days, it just means that I lose track of things really easily. And then maybe you can give it to somebody else. What do you think? But, or you can keep it and sell it on eBay. Okay, the winner of my brother's calendar is Deb Igel, I-G-E-L. Deb, reach out to Ruth Hill and we'll send you a, a calendar in a new CD. Deb Igel. Thanks for sticking around to the end. I'm, I got one more banger to finish with here. A banger? Well, uh, okay.
fighting voices in my mind that say I'm not enough. Every single lie that tells me I will never measure up. Am I more than just the sum of every high and every low? And then once again, just who I am because I'm me. You say I am loved when I can't feel a thing. You say I am when I think I'm weak. You say I am hell when I am falling short. When I don't belong, you say I'm yours. And I believe.
is done. I just wanted to remind you of a newsletter that is incredibly lovingly created uh, uh, and designed as well as a blog and a text service and Ruth has really helped to up level my game on all of these things so that I could bring you edu edutainment, some education, things that make a difference for me and others and but also entertain you and hopefully move your hopefully move you uh, in the direction of, of more of who you really are, which is love and um, less division and less fear and less living the past as if it was real. It's just something that happened and then we make up a story about what happened, right? Because some people can have something happen in their past and the story they make up is that it actually made them better even though it's like the worst thing you've ever heard of. I always give the example of Tony Robbins because he had so many terrible fathers, like six or seven different ones. And some people that would be a perfect victim excuse to have the worst life ever. But Tony's like used that to, 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 to totally rise above his situation and it made him who he was. And it, I'm always fascinated by some, the, so many people have different histories and some it makes them completely dis like a, a life that is disaster and others like they that 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 uh, those trials and tribulations make some people you know great and others it totally takes them down so which one are you and it's a choice whether you're a victim to it or are you uh, a creator and a designer with whatever you're given because some people have it really rotten and you would never know by their countenance or by their Twitter feed or whatever um, who they are is, uh, is, is grateful and, and um, so yeah just a reminder you're not your past you're not the story that you've made up about your past either and you're not limited by your past you get to create whatever you want have a beautiful Sunday. Enjoy. Uh, Kate and I actually have a course that focuses and keeps remind, bringing people back to their center, which is called the Freedom Portal. You can find that on paulgreen.com. It's an ongoing thing. Kate and I go live on there. Um, please check that out. We go live on Zoom once a month, and then we do a Q&A and on Facebook and really help people reconnect to their dreams. And some people have lost up to 80 pounds just by taking a little bit being a little kinder with themselves <laughs> all right thanks for being here and uh jackie god makes a difference of course but you can't just say that and then not do anything right god makes all the difference in the world but there's there we have a part to play in this thing as well um 
I, I feel like, you know, oftentimes we use God as a bit of a scapegoat to just say, well, I'm just going to give it up to God and that's it. And there's so much more to it. There's so much more to that. And just by, by taking action doesn't mean you're not putting God first. You know? I think people are really afraid to take responsibility because they, they just want to give it to God. But I feel like there's so much more to it. That yes, give it to God and get out of bed and, and do stuff. <laughs> so wake up and, and uh, get in the driver's seat of your life and not just... Not just uh, be dragged along by the news you're watching. Right? Okay. But I agree with you. What you said. And I just want to make sure that, you know, just give it to God and then be like, okay, it's done. There's more to it. You get to show up too. And, and be the vehicle, the vessel that's being used by God. It's like, kind of needs us to be on uh, the hands and the feet and the voice sometimes. Okay. Take her easy, you. Uh, <laughs> thanks for being here. Love y'all. And uh, and by the way, it's all just my opinion and my experience. By no means do I think I've found the truth in like, and what I share is just from my heart of something that has worked and my teachers taught me and, and, how, to, and how, to, how to live a really joyful journey. By no means do I think that, that I think I've got it like, figure it out. I'm on a journey of discovery constantly, every single day. Um, all right. Lots of love, y'all. Have a beautiful Sunday. Bye.